So this is the um, part two of the video, I apologize. This is the HD home theater control for the living room area. And I still in the living room area, I have two ethernet drops. This is, I don't know, data, um, no, 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 I don't know what I'm gonna use them for yet, but this is two cables coming from the basement, perhaps for data use. And the third ethernet spot in the living room or actually fourth, so this is another ethernet for data. So I have one, two, three, four ethernet spots for data in the living room. Um, in the dining room area, I have a home theater control right over here. And off to the master bedroom. Here in the master bedroom, I added a data cable right over here. Um, here's the builder's data cable. Here is my HDMI, uh, HDMI cable. It's gonna be, you can see kind of next to the door, if you will. I have another data cable right over here. And then I have my HDMI source here. I've got a third data cable here in the master bedroom. And this is not a data cable, but this is gonna be the whole house audio control. I kind of try to put it on my side of the bedroom, <laughs> or my side of the bed, if you will. It's gonna be right next to this light switch that's gonna control these recessed lights right above the bed. Um, I also put a home theater, whole house audio control here in the in the um, master bathroom as well, so that we can enjoy music and change music in the morning time. Um, here are the speakers cables in the master bedroom, master bathroom, speaker cable here in the master, master bathroom. Uh, here are the speaker cables here in the master bedroom, speaker cables here in the master bedroom. I try to line them up as close as possible, even as possible, the recess lights, so when it's time for me to cut the hole, I know it's gonna be exactly where it is. Uh, speaker cable here in the master living room. I'm sorry, in the living room. Another set of speaker cables here in the living room here, and, and speaker cables here in the kitchen. One set over here, and another set right over here, and last set of speaker cables in the master, in the dining room, ends right over here, speaker cables enter here. All right, so we're gonna go upstairs to the second floor. We'll start in the, where the four bedrooms up here in the second floor. Um, two will be occupied, two will not be for my two sons. All right, so Ethernet cable here from the build of Ethernet and coax. Um, HDMI red mirror from model price here. Um, and I have um, Ethernet cable over here. And I got more Ethernet cable going all the way up to get to the other rooms. I do have a couple of black ones. So it's gonna daisy chain all here is the second bedroom. Ethernet cable right over here, it ends. And we're gonna go to the other bedroom. This is, so we saw two bedrooms that are not gonna be occupied. This bedroom is gonna be occupied. HT home theater, um, whole house audio control right over here. And speaker cables over here. And more speaker cables over here. And an ethernet cable right over here. Gonna go to the bathroom. And here's the second bedroom. Um, whole house audio control here. And data cable right over here. So, oh, and last but not least, obviously, speaker cables here. Speaker cables here. So, the builder should be putting up the drywall. I think sometime next week, or 
at least the insulation will be going up this week and then perhaps the drywall will end up going up late this week and um, early next week. So for the most part, I, I'm done. I'm gonna try to post this on um, AVS forums tonight. Um, if you guys have any feedback, any instructions, any kind words, I'd greatly appreciate it. But um, yeah, it, it's been tough. I mean, I've spent solid five days doing it, but I, I think I'll be rewarded for it. Um, in terms of you know, making sure I have a nice wired house for the future. This is 2015. If you're gonna build a house, might as well have it nicely wired. So thanks guys for everything. Well, thanks everyone for helping me out and your in input and your advice. I truly appreciate it. And I guess the next set of videos will probably take place in about four or five months when I start to actually make my patches for my ethernet cable. Um, I don't anticipate doing every single last one of them at all at one time, but who knows. I hopefully will put some more 